morning in Beijing. Just hours after what some say was the most spectacular opening ceremony in Olympic history. A Chinese man fatally stabbed Todd Bachman in what officials are calling a random attack. His wife, Barbara, suffered serious injuries. The couple's Chinese tour guide was also injured. Our thoughts and prayers are with the victims and their families. And the United States government has offered to provide any assistance the family needs. The Bachmans were relatives of Hugh McCutcheon, a coach for the U.S. Olympic men's volleyball team. After stabbing the couple, the assailant committed suicide, throwing himself from the 13th century drum tower. The murder has cast a sad shadow over the first full day of Olympic competition Saturday and raised questions about security among both athletes and visitors. Tragedy, you know, to hear something like that. And, you know, um, I know we're, uh, we're well protected. Um, being in the, in the village and on the bus and transportation and the field and all that. You just have to watch and be careful and watch where you're at and just be aware of your state all at all times. Todd Bachman was the chief executive officer of Bachman's Inc., a family-owned home and garden center based in Minneapolis. China's official news agency identified the killer as a 47-year-old man from the eastern city of Hangzhou. A U.S. Olympic Committee spokesman has told the Associated Press... It's too early to say whether the American delegation or athletes will require additional security. Sandy Kozell, The Associated Press.